A controversial vote supposed to take place at tonight's Charleston County School Board meeting, but that has been tabled, put off for a month. News 2's Matt Abba was at that meeting, joins us live from the studio. Matt, a lot of people upset with the school board. Yeah, that's right, Brendan. It all goes back to six years ago when voters approved a one cent sales tax to fund the CCSD building program. But now some say the CCSD board is trying to change the decision made by voters to have Stono Elementary renovated instead of rebuilt. And do you want a new school? Yes, I want them to rebuild the school. Not renovate? No. Alexa St. Francis is a third grader at Stono Elementary. There's mold in the bathroom and sometimes when you run the water, it's very stinky. And she and her classmates say they want a new school. You know, my kids really want something better um, and, and I hope that they can get that. A teacher at Stono, Alexandra Rodas, read a letter from one of her third graders to the CCSD board pleading to build a new school instead of renovating the existing one. I just literally was brought to tears a few times. Parents like Carmen Nash addressed the board Monday night. I was appalled at the condition of the building. Charleston's new mayor, John Tecklenburg, says he is committed to a West Ashley renaissance. Last month, he supported new improvement projects for the DuPont Wapu area. And tonight, he said Stono Elementary also needs a change. So I ask you tonight, Please abandon the thought of just renovating that school and rebuild us a new school, West Ashley, at Stono Park Elementary. Thank you very much. The board was supposed to vote tonight, but instead they announced an upcoming workshop to be held on March 14th, where they'll hear from CCSD Capital Projects officials. Today, board member Michael Miller says the board requested information about the referendum project cost, the timeline to complete each project, and how much it would cost to finish every project on the list. Seemingly, the district wanted to move in a different direction, a renovation versus a rebuild. I personally think that's not the direction we should go. The board will get feedback and learn more at the March 14th workshop, and then on March 21st, they'll vote on the Stono Park project. Also new tonight, the board decided to name the new Mount Pleasant High School after longtime Wando principal, Miss Lucy Beckham. The new school will be called Lucy Garrett Beckham High. We'll have more info on that new high school tomorrow. Live in the studio, Matt Alba, News 2.